What is going on, guys? Welcome back. Commentary for you. I know, I know, some of you will be upset with the title, but here's the deal. The title is a legitimate warning, as is the beginning of this video. If you are a fan of Madden, if you don't want to see this game be exposed, then you probably should click off the video. When I make videos like this, and I don't title them that way, I get people all the time that say, I wish I'd never seen this. Why didn't you put up some type of warning? Now I can't unsee it. Every time I play the game, I notice this. So here's the deal. This is showing you the elementary level programming this game has. Now, I'm doing this because all week I've seen EA promote their competitive gamers and how well they know football, in some cases better than NFL players, and that's just preposterous. You don't know football knowing Madden. You know how to exploit some of the most simplistic programming concepts you'll ever see in a sports game. So, I guess if anyone is going to talk about it, it has to be me, because it amazes me no one else brings this up, but... I finally got to the point where, listen, enough was enough. We're going to discuss how broken this game is. We're going to focus on this receiver. Some of this might not make sense at first, but follow along. Ultimately, I know you will understand. It's so simple, you can't. So I want you to understand how this safety reacted. Whether you're going to run cover twos, shells, doesn't matter. I've taken EA's coloring system to make it simple for some of you to understand where he's supposed to be protecting. So I think we all understand zone defense, drop back in the zone, protect that zone. Madden does not have this logic right. Instead, what it does is it ties the safety to the receiver. So in this case, he runs over to where Allison ran the route, and now something has to happen for him to react. The ball's thrown, the quarterback runs, something triggers him to move. In this case, it's throwing the ball. So once the ball is released, then he will react to that and run across the field. Now, how can you prove that? I want you to watch him clear this zone out as the receiver runs the route. Now, I want you to understand the way you can prove this is the programming in the game is if you can drop back further, which I'm about to do, you'll notice the safety stays at the corner of the end zone, which is where the receiver has tied him to. So when we go back and watch this catch, very similar in terms of what he's supposed to be doing as a defender, but now the difference being there's more time for the quarterback to throw the ball, it elongates the time that he's going to stop and stand still here. It's doing that because the game knows I can't react until something happens. Watching this just as a still image, he runs completely out of the frame and then comes back across. I'm going to swipe this across the stream. Understand where he is right now, and then understand where he is when the ball gets caught. The ball is caught basically right where his zone would be, but because he's tied to the receiver, it doesn't matter. Now, when I run that receiver on a drag, I want you to understand how it impacts him. Watch how this safety reacts now that it's a drag route. He runs across to where his zone was, but then shovels inside. And this can break the play on other routes. Like if you were to run, say, out to the flat, this would break the game. So watch now. He's going to run out like he did before, but now that Allison drug across, he's going to cut inside. Now, some people will say, hey, this logic isn't in games that you're talking about, so don't be upset with Madden. But it is. Maximum football here. Watch that safety run actually over to try to get to a pass that wasn't even placed as short of a field as it was in Madden. So that's it, guys. The safeties playing zones in this game really don't play zones. They just play the routes that are being ran in front of them. And I know some people will say, well, that's part of playing safety. Agreed. But that's not all of playing safety. Appreciate you guys taking time to check this out. And you should know by now, I will be back in the week with more commentary.